Last Saturday was a, a good day for the Mercer Lacrosse program, uh, beating High Point in our first conference game. It was an exciting game throughout the 60 minutes and then the minute and a half in overtime. Uh, but one of the the, the neat things for me to see was how our, our team stayed in the system and even grew during that game. And uh, our, our young guys are gaining valuable experience and it's starting to pay off, especially on Saturday with that win. Checking out on the prison bus. Our strength of schedule in the first half of the season is definitely proving to, to help our guys develop. We've had to remain focused, we've overcome some adversity, and, uh, and I can truly see our team getting better and better each week. Uh, we're starting to develop some of our younger guys. Uh, just in our past game uh, against High Point, we had uh, 16 points produced by freshmen. So as the season continues to go, uh, we're going to get a lot of very good play from, from multiple players. And I think that's going to be one of the difficult things for opponents. We don't have one top player. We're, we're playing as a team and a lot of guys are getting involved. Coming Saturday pushes us into the second half of our season uh, with many meaningful games. But, but right now, all of our attention, focus, energy is being placed on Furman University. Uh, they, they will be our second conference game in as many weeks, and uh, we're, we're looking forward to that challenge. The one thing about Furman that stands out to me is that they continue to improve. They, they improved throughout the year last year. Um, they're, they're much better now than they were last year. They're improving every week. And, uh, and, and secondly, they are meeting with success. They're winning games. And when, when you put confidence uh, along with improvement, that makes a, a very tough team to compete against. Radio, radio.